step up onto your porch. The porch actually wraps all the way around the side of the house. You have recessive lighting in the ceiling on the porch. Step in and this is what you see. There is a, a loft upstairs as a sitting area that sees over. It's a living room area. Fireplace there. You walk through here. Have some French doors into the kitchen. They took some of the faces of the cabinets off as a foreclosure. This real nice countertops and a staggered look. Dual uh, ovens and actually has dual dishwashers. Very deep sink over there. Hardwood here. You got some French doors here that led to, I guess, a pantry at one time. They've taken the shelving out. But you've got a little pantry area here. This is coming in from the garage. You have some shelving here. Um, you still have that slate. Uh, and the build-out you were asking me about, it just is right here in this little corner area. So it doesn't look like they were going to build anything here unless they were just going to drywall that up. But here's the washing area. You got some shelves there. Two car garage. We spin around here. There's a little end room out here that was enclosed. And I spoke with the neighbor. The neighbor said the previous owners did a lot of uh, gardening in here. So almost used this as like a green room. Step out the back door that comes right out of the kitchen. Got a little porch and a nice little deck. Right here on the slab. Not sure about the property line where it ends. It seems to be ending right here at the edge of this tree line for most of the properties. But we can get a survey to confirm that. Coming back, I want to make sure you saw the chandelier here in this kitchen eating area. Um, and in your kitchen, you have got some track lighting, some stainless steel track lighting. To answer your question about a bedroom downstairs, the master is downstairs. Um, this is the master bedroom, tray ceiling, carpet, um, the nice wood blinds recessive lighting here going around it and you have a set of French doors that takes you into the very modern bathroom. Here's your two sinks. One, two, to your right over here is your toilet area that's in a private closed off door. Your tub area and then you actually have two steps up into an open shower area with a drain there. And down here, here is your walk-in closet. Good size closet. Sorry there's no power so the lighting is a little off. That's that. Well, As you reach the top of the stairs you have a, a nice little sitting area with its own ceiling fan. You have another sitting area with another fireplace up here. And this is the kind of loft that looks over into the main living room. Little diamond design on the wall.
the second bedroom. All bedrooms have a private bath. And this one's got a little linen closet, or linen shelves, excuse me. You want back across. To the third bedroom. It's a built in shelf into the wall. And then this one has um, the closet for the room. This is the one that actually has the linen closet. And then the final bath in here. This room is also your attic access with a pull down. And that's it.